Welcome to public hearings, Montgomery County Ag and Farmland Protection Plan updates. Uh, Amanda from uh, Aircraft from Economic Development is going to speak uh, briefly, and then if anybody from the public would like to speak on it, um, they are welcome. But uh, please come to the rail, state your name for the record. So, just to update everyone, as um, we've gone through the process a little bit, is that um, the Department of Public Works is currently working with the Tuesday, 7 o'clock. Madam Clerk, can the roll call, please? Chairman Headwell. Present. Legislator Wilson. Present. Legislator Chichesky. Present. Legislator Pat. Present. Legislator Isabel. Present. Legislator Patel. Legislator Kelly. Present. Legislator Sweet. Present. Legislator Dighton. Present. We'll stand for the pledge and a moment of silence. And, uh, States Army, also having served as a member of the Women's Army, Army Corps, whereas Ms. Prill also served as Director of Veterans Service Officer since September 2nd, 2014, whereas Ms. Prill has held several positions and has had over 30 years of employment with Montgomery County, whereas Ms. Prill retired from the Treasurer's Office in 2010 and returned to the county as a part-time clerk typist, senior typist, in the Veterans Service Agency in 2012, whereas Ms. Prell was appointed full-time uh, Veterans Service Officer in 2014 and became the full-time Director of Veterans Service Officer in 2016, whereas Ms. Prell has earned accreditation through the National Association of County Veterans Service Officers and also through the VFW. Whereas Ms. Pearl attended various training seminars to further her knowledge and education with the Veterans Affairs. And whereas Ms. Pearl fully understands the need for strong advocacy for the veterans and their passion of their dedication 
has shown strong char character, morals, ethics, unselfish service to honor and assist our veterans, whether it be through countless hours of casework or obtaining medals for the veterans. Whereas Ms. Pearl has gone above and beyond with her service, has been a tremendous asset to Montgomery County. Now therefore, be it resolved, County Executive Matt Awesome Fork hereby proclaims Tuesday, January 23rd, 2018 as an official date in Montgomery County to gratefully pay honor, sincerely appreciate wholeheartedly, thank Pat Pearl for his service to our country in Montgomery County and fellow veterans. Thank you. Pat for a while now and as you can see from her proclamation no matter what she did she always did it at 100% I mean that's the type of person she, she's she's always been and uh, I've known her from, from working on track meets and you know at her, at her restaurant downtown in Fultonville and, and working for the county so uh, enjoy retirement again <laughs> <laughs> And the next one we have tonight is uh, we're going to be honoring uh, Larry Coddington, longtime uh, supervisor for the uh, town of Glen. So, Larry, would you please come forward? Some of the people here I've worked with back when I was there, maybe the first time, I'm not sure. I know I was thinking the other night about how when I was there back in the 80s, 84 through 87, most of those people I served with have passed on since then. And there, you know, just a few of them around yet. And I know 85 was when we first tried to get a new form of county government. And uh, anyway, I came back and I contributed what I, what I could to it. And what I've seen so far, I've been very pleased with it. And, it's been a pleasure working, and I have always said that there was the county employees. There's a lot of good employees here that dedicated and do their job, and uh, and 
very rarely get a pat on the back, but I, I think they should, they deserve that. And anyway, thank you very much. I appreciate it. And uh, good luck with everybody. And I hope you continue success. And I got my tax bill the other day and it was lower than it was for you. <laughs> <laughs> January 16, 2018, have a motion. Motion by Kelly, second by Pep. Any discussion? All in favor? Aye. Aye. Opposed? <coughs> Stain of abstentions? Okay. Acceptance of budgetary transfers, aggregate budget transfer 2017, aggregate budget transfers January 2018, and budget transfers from December 14th, 2017 to January 19th, 2018. Have a motion? Motion by Legislator Sweet and Legislator Wilson. Any discussion? All in favor? Aye. Aye. Opposed? Abstentions? Okay. The procurement record 2000 or December 2017. A motion. Motion by Legislator Pep, second by Legislator Isabel. Any discussion? Hearing none. All in favor? Aye. 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 Opposed? Abstentions? Yes. yes. Old business. Old business. New business. Our resolutions. Resolution number nine. Resolution correcting the application for the 2018 town and country, town and county tax rolls, real property. Sponsors were Patel Wilson. Discussion? All in favor? Aye. Aye. Opposed? Abstentions? Yes. Okay. Back up. We need to, under new business, we need to amend the agenda to add resolution number 34 to the um, agenda. I have a motion? Wilson, uh, Legislator Wilson, second. Uh, Legislator Diamond, any discussion? All in favor? Aye. aye, aye. Opposed? Abstentions? Okay. <laughs> Resolution number 10, resolution appointing members to the audit committee, Kelly and Sweet. Discussion? All in favor? Aye. Aye. Opposed? Abstentions? Yes. Resolution number 11, resolution approving the abstracts of audit of claims, <coughs> Kelly and Diamond. Discussion? All in favor? Aye. Aye. Opposed? Abstentions? 
Yes. Resolution number 12, resolution amended the 2018 operating budget public works equipment. Sponsors were PEP and Diamond. Discussion? All in favor? Aye. Aye. Opposed? Abstentions. <coughs> Number 13, resolution adopt an introductory local law of 2018, local law one of 2018, and local law amending sections 2.11 and 5.01 of the Montgomery County Charter, local law two of 2012, County Legislature, Wilson and Kelly. Discussion? All in favor? Aye. Aye. Opposed? Abstentions? <coughs> yes. Resolution 14. Resolution amending the county. Resolution authorizing the county executive to execute an amendment to construction services agreement with JMZ Architects for the FMCC Allen House Project. Sponsors were PEP and Diamond. Discussion? All in favor? Aye. Opposed? Abstentions? Yes. Okay. Resolution 15, resolution authorizing the county executive to execute change order number two with Bishop Utri Construction for the FMCC Allen House Project. Sponsors were Pep and Wilson. Discussion? All in favor? Aye. Aye. Opposed? Assumptions? Yes. Resolution 16, resolution confirming the appointment made by the county exec. Sponsors were Diamond and Pep. Discussion? All in favor? Aye. 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 Opposed? Abstentions? Yes. Resolution number 17, resolution rescinding resolution number 248 of 2017 and rescheduling a public hearing for Montgomery County Agricultural and Farmland Protection Plan. Sponsors were Kelly and Pep. Discussion? All in favor? Aye. Aye. Opposed? Abstention? Yes. Resolution number 18, resolution rescinding Resolution 281 of 2017 and adopting the Montgomery County Agricultural and Farmland Protection Plan update. Sponsors were Kelly and Wilson. Discussion? All in favor? Aye. Aye. Opposed? Discussions? <coughs> yes. Resolution 19. Resolution amending the 2018 operating budget 2017-2018 Somerville Trail Grant in aid program. Sponsors were Kelly and Sweet. Discussion? All in favor? Aye. Aye. Opposed? Abstentions? Yes. Resolution number 20, resolution accepting grant application for Montgomery County Courthouse ADA compliance Project, Home, and Community Renewal. Sponsors were Kelly and Sweet. Discussion? All in favor? Aye. Aye. Opposed? Sentence. Yes. Resolution number 21. Resolution accepting grant application for Montgomery County Micro uh, Enterprise Project, Home, and Community Renewal. Sponsors were Pep and Kelly. Discussion? All in favor? Aye. Aye. Opposed? Abstentions? Yes. Number 22, resolution scheduling the second public hearing, Dollar General Distribution Center, CDBG Program, Office of the Homes and Community Renewal. Sponsors were Wilson and Pep. Discussion? All in favor? Aye. Aye. Opposed? Abstentions? Yes. Resolution number 23, resolution accepting grant application from Montgomery County, Exit 29, Site, Reuse, Analysis, and amending the 2018 Operating Budget, Department of State. Resolution, or responses were Kelly and Diamond. Discussion? All in favor? Aye. Aye. Opposed? 
sections. Resolution number 24. Resolution authorizing county executive to sign the New York State Legal Service Grant Contract Distribution 7. Sponsors were Kelly and Wilson. Discussion? All in favor? Aye. Aye. Opposed? Yes. Resolution number 25. Resolution authorizing the county exec to sign a renewal of Agreement 2018 Transportation of Fulton County Veterans, Youth, ATI, and Veteran Services. Sponsors were Kelly and Pep. Discussion? All in favor? Aye. Aye. Opposed? Abstentions. Yes. Resolution number 26. Resolution amending the 2018 operating budget. Sponsors were Sweet and Diamond. Discussion? All in favor? Aye. 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 Opposed? Abstentions. Yes. Resolution number 27. Resolution authorizing the county exec to sign agreement for inmate electronic law library services, uh, Lexis Nexus. Sponsors were Kelly and Wilson. Discussion? All in favor? Aye. 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 Opposed? Abstentions. Yes. Okay, resolution number 28. Resolution amending the 2018 operating budget uh, 2016 statewide interoperable communication grant program. Sponsors were Pertel and Diamond. Discussion? Right. Chair, I'd like to uh, make an amendment to resolution number 28, and the amendment uh, will read uh, we need to add a resolve clause. Uh, uh, it'll re resolve the Montgomery County Legislature. Hereby authorizes the county executive to sign said contract and authorize the purchase of said equipment. I have a second. Awesome. Second, uh, Legislator Pep. Okay. Any discussion on the amendment? Okay. All in favor of the, the amendment? Aye. 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 Opposed? Extensions on the amendment. Okay. Now we'll have the. Uh, on the uh, resolution, uh, we uh, all have discussion or discussion on the uh, change. Okay, all in favor? Aye. 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 Opposed? Abstentions. As amended. As amended. Yes. Resolution number 29 resolution accepting the FY 2017 State Homeland Security Program. Grant from New York State Homeland Security and amending the 2018 operating budget. Sponsors were Kelly and Sweet. Discussion? All in favor? Aye. 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 Opposed? Exception. Okay. Number, resolution number 30. Uh, resolution accepting the, the FY 2017 State Emergency Management Performance Grant for the New York State Homeland Security and amending the 2018 operating budget. Sponsors were Diamond and Sweet. Discussion, Chairman, or um, Legislator Diamond. Uh, thank you, Chair. Uh, I'd like to withdraw my sponsorship of this resolution. Uh, there's some additional work that uh, needs to be done and uh, we'll need to have it uh, reintroduced to the legislature. Does anyone else want to pick this up? If not, the resolution has been pulled. Okay. okay. Resolution number 31, res resolution authorizing the county executive to sign and execute, execute a contract agreement entry. Uh, Pep and Kelly. <coughs> Discussion? All in favor? Aye. Aye. Opposed? Abstentions. <coughs> yes. Resolution number 32. Resolution authorizing the county executive to enter an intermunicipal agreement for services from the Amsterdam Fire Department, City of Amsterdam. 
Sponsors were Pep and Diamond. Discussion? All in favor? Aye. Aye. Opposed? <coughs> Extensions. Resolution number 33, a resolution amended the 2018 operating budget, except in the stop DWI crackdown enforcement award. The sponsors were Wilson and Kelly. Discussion? Legislator Pat. Mr. Chair, I'd like to propose an amendment to this resolution to change the amounts in the resolved clause to $8,530.46 for both the revenue and the appropriation funds. We have a second. Second by Legislator Kelly. Discussion? Yes, just uh, this came up last week uh, at the committee meeting. And just for clarification, this was a $10,000 grant that uh, pertained to a period from October of last year through September of this year. Uh, and uh, we passed a resolution in October to appropriate 3000 of it to the 2017 budget because they wanted to implement the uh, stop DW or the DWI checkpoints in, in 2017 throughout the close of the year. So that left $7,000, and that was the amount that was on the resolution as it appeared before. As it turned out, they only used about $1,500 of it, and so uh, adding that the remaining $1,500 back to that line item brings us up to that uh, approximate $8,500 uh, figure. So just wanted to explain the math behind it and the reasoning behind it, and it's expected that the, uh, the 8530 will be expended uh, between now and the month of September uh, when uh, the, the, the grant uh, time limit is up. Thank you. Okay. All in favor of the amendment? Aye. 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 Opposed? Stations. Are we all in favor of the resolution as amended? Aye. Aye. Opposed? Resolution to authorize Resolution authorized Montgomery County Purchasing Department to call for bids for Montgomery County culvert replacement in the towns of Florida and Amsterdam. I need a sponsor. Sponsor Legislator Kelly, Legislator Wilson. Discussion. Commissioner, would you like to, real quick, explain what's the urgency? I'm, I mean, we never brought this up, but there was an urgency to get this done, so. Yeah, well, basically, what uh, I'm sure everybody's aware of, uh, back from Hurricane Irene and Lee, the uh, towns of uh, Florida and Amsterdam were both awarded $3 million for infrastructure repair for uh, whatever things that pertain to the town's needs after the floods. I think Amsterdam already did. Let's well, see, so we did Miami Culvert up on uh, Miami Ave, and we did some generator replacements in the town of Amsterdam. Uh, this is uh, almost a $2 million project for town of Florida. And there's another couple hundred thousand dollars for the culvert repair yet in County Amsterdam. Uh, the urgency for this is the bid documents are about ready to go, um, and we're trying to get ahead of the 2018 construction schedule. Um, so there's absolutely there's no it's all uh, federal funded. There's no county share, no match in the town of Board of County. Uh, actually, part of the grant you can reimburse to some of my office staff for work completed on. It. On the project, so uh, the urgency was to get this out here tonight, so that we can get this out to bid throughout the month of February. Uh, we'll get the bid back March, award April, with the May first, uh, that you know, target date for construction to begin. Uh, without this happening tonight, we could be looking at a June first, and it could affect some of our bids. Maybe come in higher, some contractors may already be. Uh, Filling up their workload for the summer, so we're just trying to uh, get ahead of it. Okay. Thank you. Any other? What is, this is the county going to be performing the work? No, it's all going to be subbed out to contract. Okay. Any other discussion? Okay. All in favor? Aye. 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 Opposed? Abstentions? Yes. Anything other? Other, other. <laughs> Hearing none, I have a motion.
motion to adjourn. Motion by Kelly, second by Pat. Thank you.